top five best money making methods. Now, if you're stuck making money or you just need methods to start making money again, I've got five in this video, so go ahead and stay tuned for all of them five. Now, the first money making method is to go ahead and go to Slime Island and just to go ahead and grind these slimes right in front of me. Now, there's a bunch of benefits to this actual method is that you actually don't need a level to get to this island. You only really need is a stone sword or a wooden sword, any sword what does damage to these mobs. And now, when you're actually killing these slimes a lot of people actually don't notice but they give you slime balls and now this is how you can go ahead and level up your economy level now if we actually head back into the hub and talk to the adventurer right here you can sell all your slime balls to this person to get economy level while you're doing this but yeah other than that this method's really good and to make this even more powerful is you can actually go ahead and go into a public server and go ahead and wait for people to spawn the slime king plus you get a free summon every 15 minutes what is really good now you can actually go ahead and sell these gears to a publish shop or you can actually go ahead and buy proplus and publish your own shop and sell them for even more but still just selling those actually to a publish shop gives you so much money and now the second method is to set up some type of farm now for example this could be a cry iron farm or a wood farm what i've got right here now i've got a wood farm right there and a mini pine Pineapple farm, what gives me crates, what it doesn't give me that much, but does give me some over time, as you can see. Another good thing about having these farms is that you can kind of set them up in AFK and just get money. But another good thing about like a wood farm is that every single time you mine maybe one of these trees, I get four hickory wood. Now, say they probably sell for around 3,500 per wood. Now, that is around 10,000 coins by just mining one single tree. And just that alone, you could make so so much money by just setting up a simple AFK farm. And now the third one is to sell any items what you've grinded slash afk So say for example if I AFK'd these little wizard lizards, I could go ahead and maybe sell the spell books to published islands or sell them at my own shop and make quite a fair bit of money. Now a better method would be to AFK crystallize iron. Now I have a method on this and I can go ahead and sell that or go ahead and make vending machines to invest in my shop in the future. But yeah, that one's pretty straightforward. Just any item you grind slash AFK, go ahead and sell it to a published island so you can make a lot of money. And now for the fourth one, sell any limiteds to any published shop or your own shop. Now this way, you can go ahead and make so much money. This is how I made a lot of my money, is by grinding the event, or at least getting one of the events. So say, for example, the new Halloween event one just went away, unfortunately. But you could go ahead and get the cauldrons, where if you at least grinded one, as soon as they became untradeable, you buy and sell them, and then you make so much money. And now, usually what I do is wait a couple days for them to go down in price to start buying and selling them, since they're gonna be very unstable at first, and you can lose quite a fair bit of money. But like, even if they are really expensive, you can make so much money from just selling them to shops, even if you just grinded all the items, and you just want to get rid of them, like you don't have any care to keep them, and you just want to make money, just sell them to published islands, they go for so much, like the cauldrons have been going for around 200 million plus I've seen, what is quite insane in my opinion. And then for the last and final one, it's just to build your own shop. And now, it might be hard to build your own shop, but it's going to be worth it. Now, if I actually place down an ATM, I can go ahead and show you how much money alone I've just made from my shop. Now, my shop is no longer there since I no longer need it with the amount of money what's in here. But if I go ahead and open this ATM, I have 50 billion coins in my bank account that is all made from my shop. Now, I can make up to 5 billion in an hour if you manage your money right and you sell the right items. Now, how do you get 5 billion, you may ask? It's pretty much limited to any high demand trophies, weapons, or anything like that. Sticky gears can make quite a fair bit, gearboxes, anything like that. And this is what I'm saying about if you grind anything, you can go ahead and sell gearboxes at your own shop and make so much more money. Even if you start out with tier 1 vending machines, you can slowly work your way to tier 2 in the future, but having a basic shop base down is pretty good to start off with. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video and you thought it was helpful, click on this video right up here because it's going to explain to you the top 5 best items to grind to sell in your shop.